Dear Bob and Linda, David and Simone's wedding day has arrived and the festivities have begun. Glenn and I wish that we had the opportunity to meet and get to know you both. Simone and David make an amazing couple and we see them bring out the best in one another. We promise to love and cherish Simone as the daughter we never had, but are now so very blessed to have. After my mom passed, and then my dad, I had spent my life chasing that feeling of home, and I finally found it in you. I'm so handsome, babe. <laughs> Don't cry. Simone came into the picture when David, my brother, and I were all living together in Seattle. That year, a light bulb went off in David's head. He was done with the bachelor life. <laughs> Simone's name started popping up in our conversations. Right away, you could tell there was something different about this girl. And so today, David is coming and he is marrying into this big family. And the thing about big families is it's really less about the marrying of individuals and it's more about the merging of communities. And that's what today is about. You have to understand the leap that Moni had to take. And how the leap she took and the person she took that leap towards was truly exceptional. And that's how outstanding David is. I'm overwhelmed by the support I feel from you on a daily basis. And I vow to be a man of service. to be a man of service to you and your family for the rest of my life. I, I never had the pleasure of meeting your mom, but knowing your dad, they would both be so proud of you. The woman, daughter, friend, and now wife that you would be. I feel happy to tell Daddy Bob and Mama Linda that Moni is okay, because that was a big fear for them. Um, I remember they were very scared, and they said to us, like, take care of her. Um, they were really scared, because they knew they were leaving her so young. So I feel happy that we can say she's okay, and I feel happy that we can tell them that uh, Mama Linda's wish came true. think of home, I think of a place that was overflowing with unconditional love, acceptance, and happiness. <laughs> David, you are my home. You are now my favorite place in this world. 